so from past a uh, couple of days i was getting a question like two or three times that what kind of books should we create when we are starting out and uh how should i create it etc etc so if you are starting out i would suggest and what i had done when i had started out is that i was going with uh, journals or notebooks okay because it is easy to create and you are just creating you are finding the niches you are creating it you are uploading it and that is fun right so what i would do is in this video i'm going to show you how you can create notebook or journal in no time easy and quickly for free so hello everyone this is Priyanka Dubey here if you are new to the channel please support my channel because I am putting a lot of efforts into this channel and if you have already subscribed please keep supporting keep sharing uh, keep commenting keep liking my videos so yeah thank you so much so let's get started so the first first thing that you need to create for the general or the notebook is the cover and the second thing that we you need to create is the interior right and these are the two things that i'm going to create in this video so for the cover we want to know what exactly size are we looking for so what you will do is you will go into the new tab and you will type kdp cover template once you are done you have to create the kdp cover calculator i want to calculate it so i will go ahead and uh, i will put in my information so the binding type will be paperback if you are creating the hardcover you can choose hardcover but now i am creating paperback so it will be paperback interior type would be just black and white paper type would be just white paper or you can choose the cream as well depending upon what you are going for paste on direction is obviously left to right measurements units now inches because uh, i am taking the size into inches interior trim size is the size that actually you are looking for so for now i am going for 6 into 9 inches that is the pocket size and the least size is 5 into 8 but i am going for 6 into 9 and the standard is 5 8.5 into 11 um so but for now i am going for 6 into 9 okay now number of pages that you would love to have generally in a notebook or a journal uh, the pages are 120 so I have just taken 120 and now you have to calculate dimensions so now it will show you that what dimensions will it look like and from now I will just download that template once you will download the template you will open it up you will open it up and then you will get to see that how it looks like okay so it will look like something like this so in this you can see the 6 into 9 inches book uh, size in is this one but the overall dimension is 12.5 into 9.250 so this is my cover size okay so what i will go quickly is to go into the canva and i will small it up and i will create a size i will create a custom size i will convert this into inches and then I would love to see once more at what was the size it was 12.520 12 12.520 uh, into 9.250 9.250 okay let me check once again 12.520 into 9.250 okay that's fine now I will create a new design and I will upload this image into the Canva. I have already done for you guys. So we have that uh, image already with us. So now once it's done, what I will do is I will just go into the uploads and I will do this one like this. Okay. Now once I am done here, I have just uh, taken my size and it's looking good now i have to create this one that is in the middle part so i will go into lines and shapes and i will choose this one and i will just shift it to match like this okay and i will just adjust it now once it's done what i will do is i will remove it out and now i will create the cover now this is the back part this is the uh, front part of my book notebook now i have to share i have to uh, design the cover 
so for the cover i just want a pattern to go for the notebook so for the site that i use is bixi i have attached the link in the description you can go ahead and you can just uh, explore it so here i will suggest such and i will just go ahead and i will search whatever i want to suggest like for example uh red pattern or anything like that you want you can just search whatever you want okay so from here i will just go ahead and i will suggest red pattern background or blue or black or whatever you want so let me just take a look at it so this these are all free so you can use it but these are not free so if you have a account that is if you have a pro account then you can use this image images otherwise you can use the free images for free okay so for now i will just pick one i am not putting my more mind into it because i'm just giving you an example so what i will do is i will pick one let's suppose red flower pattern or flower pattern let's suppose that it's it's just flower pattern okay flower pattern is not available in free okay here it is i think this one looks good if you want to select some for kids you can pick one this one similarly you can choose whatever you want from these options over here so i have selected one like this one i am it looks good to me i will download it free license once it's been downloaded you have to open it i will go into the canva and i will upload it so here it is jpg okay i have selected it right now i will just drag it up to cover the full coverage you can do something like this or you can do just like this and then duplicate it and you can then again do it so you can do both face i think it looks awesome so now i will just create the front one so again you have to go into the lines and shapes and you have to choose like this then you can design it whatever way you want let's suppose it should be like this and it should be this you can i think it looks pretty good and now i will write the word notebook i will just select the text and i will write notebook or journal or whatever you want okay and i will write it down here if you want to select the font or change the font you can do it from here it is not looking good to me it is not also not looking good to me mm, a big no or or else i can do that i guess let's let's go into the corporate and let's select one i think it looks pretty good so yeah i think it looks good now we are done with the upper part now we have to uh just copy the same exact text that we have here on the spine as well that is the, this one this part okay 
so change the color to like black because it is not looking good to me or it can it, it is looking good to me also you can just get it this like okay now we will duplicate it and i will reduce the size but we have to see that where this size goes okay so again i will just put it here like this and it should come in this middle part in this white section okay so i will just go i will just pick it up and i will just move it like this into the 90 degrees and then again i will reduce the size and i will put it in the middle okay because it is coming into the spine and again select it and delete it and you are good to go that's all <laughs> the cover is done it looks pretty good right so your front cover is done now our second part of the video that is the interior now for the interior we want uh, a lined journal or notebook right so according to the kdp there should be a bleed uh, margin and that is 0 0.125 let's go into the calculation that we had done you can see the bleed is 0 0.125 and the margin should be 0 0.125 like here here and here okay so accordingly we will go ahead and we will create a new design uh, in this canva for the uh, i will say for the interior sorry okay cost now into the custom size the size would be uh, it was 6 into 9 right this one was 6 into 9 so taking the margin into consideration it will it will be 6 uh, 6 plus 0 0.125 that is 6.125 into 9.250 correct then going to the inches sorry again i have to write 6.125 into 9.250 now we will create the new design for the interior now it is our interior okay we are taking 120 pages and remember canva only allows 100 paper 100 papers in one design like you can duplicate it you can add pages up to 100 so what we will do is we will create first 20 pages and then we'll keep, keep on adding up to 100 it will be easier for us okay so now what we have to do is we have we have to go ahead and we have to create our line so i think go into the lines and shapes just select this kind of line and you can um, change the style no do not change the style just go ahead and change the width if you want like this and change the color a bit like this and then you can go ahead you can just put it up and you can extend it like this make sure that it is not it is not in aligned it should be aligned okay now go ahead and duplicate it again and take the uh, proper uh, size and then again put it back again duplicate it use it and put it back now once again you are done with like three or four uh, lines what you have to do is you will just go ahead and you will select these lines these all four you will group it and then you will go ahead and you will duplicate it so now you will getting four line at once this is a trick again you will just go ahead and put it like this again copy put it like this okay you have to do this up to like end and then again you have to duplicate it okay once you have done the duplication you have to duplicate it up to 20 pages and then you will download it and then again you will do it for like 100 pages and you will download it now you got the two things i am not going to do the whole process because obviously creating and again downloading and uh, doing all these things are going to take a lot of time so what i have done is i have done the part already and what you have to do is once you have downloaded the 20 pages and 100 pages 
and how you will download it you will simply go into the download you will select the pdf print and you will download simple okay once you are done with the 20 pages and the rest of the 100 pages you will go into another software that is called merge pdf and you will merge the 20 and the 100 pages that you have just created okay you will merge it and it will be just it will be converted into a single pdf file of 120 pages this is a uh, this is the thing that i do when i create the notebooks okay so this is very easy this is quite easy you can go ahead and you can start doing this part so i have just described you two things the cover and the uh, what i say the interior but if you are facing problems in creating the interior i am giving you a gift yes <laughs> if you are supporting my channel again thank you so as a gift and i have also crossed like 100 subscribers so i'm giving you a gift of the interior of this notebook for free okay so you can go ahead and you can download it and you can go ahead and you can use it start creating the books of your notebooks so i hope you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the video let me know in the comment section below if you have any other video request let me know in the comment section below as well keep supporting guys and i will keep you supporting uh, from my side as much as i can so yeah that's all for the video i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next